let's see I'll start here in my kitchen today we'll do a little short tour of my uh, studio little studio apartment I mean the kitchen is today is what is today today is February the 10th Black History Month and uh, that's a Haitian painting look like acrylic I picked it up at a flea market some time ago I don't know where I probably have a couple more around here somewhere and that's brother Malcolm this photo was taken by a friend of mine Miss Alice Wyndham St. Louis around 1964 if I'm not mistaken that's that Ghana old airport uh, and I cry Ghana that was his last visit there. And here we have, uh, as you walk in, that's called Cooling Out. It's at one of my favorite places of relaxation. It used to be in or is formerly known as Jerry Pond Tavern. It's back in the day, like around 60s, 50s and 60s. We walk around here. That's a war. That's a, what is this? This is a, I call it La Connoisseur. It's a, acrylic and oil on cardboard, I believe. And, uh, let's get a close up here. And, uh, this is Brother Duke. Do one of this, this uh, celebration. They had here in Chicago some time ago. Now I walk around here. This is uh, uh two minutes. Call this flashback here. Old army sing. See those heels in the back? That's the objective. That's where you got to go. That's where we had to go. <laughs> Let me see. This is uh, from an old drawing I found here. Here, tucked away safely in some sketch pad. I just took it and framed it up. This was taken, this was made in uh, Ghana. In Abaka, Abaka, a little place called Abaka. That's a suburb of Accra, Ghana. 60, what was that? About 1972, I believe. The top one is one of my favorites. I call it the uh, Boston Harbor. You see Boston, the harbor in the background. It's just sitting out on the balcony, I believe, somewhere. Next to it is <laughs> In the Moment. How about that? That sounds like a good title for it. It's oil and acrylic on paper. Next to it is Make Me Clean. That's the title I give it. That was some drawing I made in, a painting from, a, well, it's a drawing really that I worked up into a, to a painting. Next to it is Stairway, Gallery Stairway. And those. And what do we have here? We have a, a collage, one of my favorite people, Dr. Margaret Bell. This was on her 90th, 90th birthday, 91st birthday, I believe. A red hat. One of the red hatters. I get back and get a closer look at it. Yeah, you get a good look here from here. And this angle here. That's one of the Akuba dolls. And at the top there is, uh, what is that? Stood up. Yeah, stood up. I guess we have all dealt with that at some time or other during our life. It's a close up. And below is the African Village School. 
the little schoolhouse in the middle of the forest. Just made a sketch of it, and then later on, you know, painted it. That's an albino. As a matter of fact, you don't see too many albinos. At least I had never seen out of my 11 years. I think I've, I've only seen one. And uh, that's a Peruvian, Afro-Peruvian dancer at the top. And uh, beneath there is Mandela. It's sort of a collage and mixed media on board. You know, actually, that's a wooden pan. It's the lid of uh, a wine creek. Okay. It's one of my Facebook friends to the left there. And to the right is a scene I visualized in the <laughs> from Ghana. You know, we have all kinds of ceremonies out there. So this captured my attention. This is oil on canvas. At the top there is, um, if you can make that out, in the center is the aftermath of policy maker. And you know, that's the old scene, the, uh, this is one of my political statements here. It's a collage of clippings I took out of a newspaper the day after 9-11. I just kept them and I decided to assemble them later. This one, um, I get over here and get a little closer here. I call this Take One With Minds. It's a model. And next to it is Night Owl. Oh, that's the title I give it. I gave it uh, Night Owl. All on paper next to it. Both of those are all on. Card, not what is that? Paper, paper, yeah. Okay, beneath there, next to it here, this one here is a balcony, lady on a balcony, Lake Shore Drive, overlooking, overlooking Lake Shore Drive, having something cool. And at the top we have, uh, I'm gonna crook in my neck. At the top we have uh, the night owl, she's getting ready. Oh, she's ready. And beneath that, uh, this is, I've done this with a palette knife, I believe. The orchid grower. It's about 14 by 14. Now I'll turn around here. I don't know what this is. I picked this up somewhere. I think it was at a flea market. And uh, actually, it's a uh, it's a puzzle. You know, crossword. No, a puzzle. One of Nama Rockwell painting that someone made a puzzle. A similar, and made it into a puzzle. And a couple of those from my carvings here. And of course, I didn't carve them. Those are ebony. Uh, ebony scene. Go with that telephone again and keep ringing. Bertha Kit. This was this was her last note. It's all on paper. I move up here. This is inside my, my little workshop here. Well, I won't go there. At the top there is uh, this is Jerry Pawn Tablet. This is her, that's a painting. It's all on canvas. With Willie Picking, you see in the background, you see the uh, Parkery Ballroom and Vaughn Freeman, you know, so Billy Holiday. Look at the better shot inside. Yeah, was. And uh, now we are moving to a uh, little work area here. <clears throat> kind of crowded. 
Water for Papa Bear. <laughs> That's what I call him. This the one on the right. <coughs> That's my old friend. From memories, that's uh, my Angelo, that's right. It's a still life I put together here. Oh, here, yeah, this is a good one here. This is the lovers. Yes, African. Ah, uh, yeah. Let me get down here and get a good one of them. That's the Getting ready to have some fun. Okay, this is what I'm working on now, as we speak. It's a senior. I'm doing a few paintings of seniors. This is one of my Facebook friends, too. We never met in person. And there's, uh, I call this Osu. Osu is an area, area in uh, Accra. Sort of like middle class area, if you want to see. Beneath that is two ladies on the balcony and uh, a go go. That's my little African village, adopted village. I thought this was on a cruise ship <clears throat> as we went to the Strait of Mandela. Yeah, that's a key point. Cold down there. Okay. Mama's baby. Let's put this in the back top here. So I'm semi nude now. Behind here we have, if I can get this here, this is uh, with the young lady with the, med with the medicine ball exercise. That's what she's doing, taking exercise. Or doing her exercise routine. Next to it is uh, a memory from uh, Rio de Janeiro. <laughs> and beneath there is jazz. Uh, well, it's not really jazz, but well, it could be. This is uh, Steppers. And next to it is the Traveling Eye. I got inspired for that. Both of all of these are all on canvas here. That it. Yeah, I think that's about it. Okay. Oh, back here. Here is uh, <laughs> to be continued. I believe that paintings should speak for themselves, or they should tell their own story. This is a. Uh, Real black warriors here. Okay. That's one of a senior I met. I saw a picture. I was impressed with her picture. Uh, profile picture, I believe. I have a few more touch-ups to do on these here. Misty, the ballerina dancer. Okay. And this is another work in progress. In process. Okay. I'm doing this. I'm doing this from a, from a photograph, see? These are two other. After 32 years of making jewelry, goldsmith and so forth, I'm now back, the last four years I've been back into my first love, back with my first love, which is a painting, or a painting. I probably have about 35 or 40 here so far. Oh, here's another one. Can I see? Another work of art. This is all, both of these, this is all on on canvas. I guess that's about it. Yeah, so, artists doing what artists do. Paint, draw. 
Okay. So I guess that's about it. Oh, I get one more, see if I can get this one in here. So close to it. <laughs> this is a working process. Okay. Well, ladies and gentlemen, friends, that's brothers and sisters, I guess that's it for today. And have a great day. Wow, you see, I didn't know I had so much. <laughs> I'll be hanging from the ceiling pretty soon. Okay, this is it for today, and have a nice weekend. Okay, peace, peace. All right, let me get this.